hello, hello, hello. You are tuning into another episode of The Wonderkin Show. Today's first topic. Oh my God. Kyle Hamilton comes up limping. Look. At this point, at this point, I want to make sure that I say this at this point. I'm, 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 I'm at the, I'm at the level headedness of saying that somebody's put bad juju on the Ravens. Bad Juju has been placed on the Ravens. You know what I'm saying? And then y'all want to go get Juju Smith-Schuster with the name. His name is Juju. No! I don't want no more Juju on this team, in this team, around this team. None. Jesus, God. I could have... Bro. 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 I want to make sure that I, I make my, my, my feelings totally known. Kyle Hamilton is our best defensive player. And it, I don't even think it's an argument. Roquan is the heart, but the best defensive player that we have, especially the player that allows us to um, play and disguise our coverages, I don't even understand how you even make up for his loss. The games and times that he missed, the defense are totally different. Now, you can make an argument for Roquan it looking different and stuff like that, but Kyle is the better defensive player overall. This is no shade, no hate, no nothing. So this came up from Jeff Zebra yesterday. He said, scary moment late in Ravens practice. All pro safety. Kyle Hamilton went down with what appeared to be a left leg injury. Oh. Why me? Why me? Oh, oh, oh. Let's continue reading. Hamilton was down for a bit before limping off. Ultimately walked back to locker room with a bit of a limp. Okay. Try to calm down. Try to calm down, Nitro. So this is what. So let me let me read this off. Cause some of y'all, cause the thing is, when I be tripping or tripping out and I be getting mad, some of y'all be like, oh, it's no big deal. Just calm down. It's just a preseason. Everything will be all right, Nitro. That's what y'all be trying to come out and tell me. Let me read this off to you real quick, right? Shout out to Sarah Ellis for putting this on her Twitter. Cause I always give shouts to who did what when I'm reading. This is what she wrote on Twitter. There have been several Raven injury scares recently. But many outlooks are positive. You got to put a little bow at the end, a little silver lining at the end. Updates per John Harbaugh. Kyle Hamilton looks stable. Obviously, we'll continue to do some tests tonight and tomorrow to make sure. But first indication is that he's doing fine. Okay. Nate Wiggins, shoulder. Wiggins is not a serious in injury. It's the same one that I got last week on the water slide drill. Look at my movement. I would have been active for the game, so I think we're good. Yeah, okay. Linderbaum, neck. <laughs> Yo, mind you, the first two was leg, shoulder. At this point, knees and toes is probably going to be coming up after this. But whatever, we're going to keep reading. So neck. Harbaugh wasn't asked about him, but Jeff Zebert reported Ravens being cautious, but feel good about week one. Arthur Molette, knee scope. That's still going to be something that's going to um to go on probably the first couple of weeks of the season. Rashad Bateman rib. We do expect bait back really soon. I don't want to speak for him, but I think he's right there. Oh! Bro, listen, Harbaugh's a politician. I don't believe in anything he's saying this, but whatever. Let's keep going. Ajabo, me. <laughs> I do think. He will be cleared for preseason game, but that's up to the doctors. They decide that. They just didn't clear him for this game. I'm anticipating he will be, but we'll see. He's practiced full speed today. He looked pretty good. Devontae Walker, rib. He's been dealing with the rib thing, so he's been a little limited with that. It looked good this week. It's nothing happens. It, it's like to see him out there uh, and take a lot more reps, and we'll really see what he can do. I, uh, Adisa Isaac, hamstring, I would say right on schedule. This is the first day of limited practice, so I hope he ramps up quickly. TJ Tampa, hernia surgery. He's getting close. It's probably not this week, but he's getting close. Rasheen Ali and Sanus Kane, both guys, ended up being kind of stinger injuries in the game. They'll be fine. How does the Ravens already have a full injury report after one preseason game? And y'all don't believe there ain't bad juju on this team? Jesus, God. Listen, listen. I'm going to be real with you. I don't care what none of y'all say. I read all of that. Bait. Devon. T T Tez. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking at this like, bro. So right now, Aguilar is our number two wide receiver. But forget all that. We on Kyle. Kyle is him. Right? He the baby face killer. Like Roquan, he already, you already know he like, 
he growling at you and stuff like that. Kyle's the hi. And they'll take your face off. He's the baby face killer. Kyle, don't be hurt. <laughs> don't be hurt, Kyle. I'm here. God, why? <laughs> Soft kitty, warm kitty, little ball of fur. <laughs> Happy kitty, sleepy kitty, purr, purr, purr. Hopefully that helps. Oh! Why us? Why oh! injury so blatant in the Ravens? Oh! Even people are not even affect, not even on the Ravens team right now. It's still getting injured, bro. It has to be something that they're giving them at their pro days, bro. It has to be. It has to be. Lamar Jackson was never sick, never nothing in college. Man comes to Baltimore, he get the bubble guts every couple weeks. Bateman, same thing, leg injuries, arm injuries. Soon as he gets to Baltimore, bang, out. It's just, like, bro, bro, it's a, listen, it's bad enough having to deal with the abysmal wide receivers. We're not talking about Zay. We're not talking, and, and when I say abysmal, I say that means below average. <laughs> below average receiving core that we've usually had, right? Now, our best defensive player went down. And they're going to, listen, this is the Ravens. Remember the other, oh, yeah, he's good, he's fine. How many times have you heard John, Bo John Harbaugh say, oh, they're good, they're fine, they'll be back real soon, and it turned out to be an entire season that that guy's out for. Half the season, the guy's out for, and stuff like that. And then, oh, it's excuses. Well, you know this, I'm not going to talk on it no more, because last time I told you I something, that I got hit for it. How many times have you done that? He's a politician. They dance around the truth. They dance around the facts. They sprinkle a little bit of facts here to give the illusion of what they want over here. That's politics. And he's politicking. Listen, man, my eye hurts, bro. I just... Uh, I know I'm going to have a migraine at work today. I know I am. I know I am. You know what the crazy thing is? Maybe I should soak my feet in some warm water. And actually, that works. If y'all didn't know, listen. They, oh, <laughs> fact alert. Fact alert. If you soak your feet, and hot water, as hot as you can tolerate, it actually dilates your uh, your your the cells in your foot or whatever else it is, it, it, your blood vessel. Sorry, and it brings the blood down from your head, which uh, you know what I'm saying allows migraines to subside. Subside. So yeah, if you did not know that, if you have migraines, soak your foot in hot water. It's hot as you can tolerate, and your migraines will just. Melt away. See, I know I'm going to have a migraine. So I'm trying to help y'all out too. Because after hearing this, y'all probably going to have migraines too. Bro, Kyle Hamilton out, bro. I just can't believe. Like, bro. And you're, at this point, I'm dead serious. I don't care how bad our wide receivers are. Keep Juju over there. I don't want no more Juju on this team. It's been too much. It even affects players and not even on this team no more. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. But what do you guys think? Are you sad to hear Kyle Hamilton went down? Are you sad to hear about that long injury report that we're already doing after one preseason game? Are you surprised at it? Or are you saying, bro, something got to give, something got to change? Let me know what you think down in the comment section, please. All right? You know what I'm saying? But as always, <gasps> this episode of the Wonderkind show. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Y'all know how we get down. We have fun and we laugh. But everything we talk about rooted in what? Facts and truth. Please do remember, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, leave a comment. You know I love the comments. If you haven't done so already, check out the one that controls Patreon. Yes. Three tiers of content, goodness, wave of your consumption. Give it a look, give it a try. Let me know what you think. And if you'd like to donate to this channel, help out with equipment and such stuff like that, bottom of the screen, QR code. QR codes to a cash app. Cash is located in the description of every video that we do. Name of it is Money Sign, The Wonderkin Show. Super easy. Well, once again, this is the Wonderkin Show. This is your host, Dr. Signing Off. And as always, you know my slogan. Peace. And I am 
out of here. Please, Kyle, get better soon. <gasps> yeah! Finish him, Daddy. Oh!